and welcome to another Slippy Olympics video. Um, today I've come out um, just because of the break and the weather really uh, this past week and a bit being a pretty pretty stormy. Today I really want to try and catch a variety of species. Um, probably a little early for wrasse just yet um, but should be codlin, pollock, um, Hopefully a mackerel or two. I still haven't had one of them yet. And I don't know if you can see behind me as well. There's actually uh, a load of birds diving over there. And that's because the sand eels have, have finally arrived. Since it is so rough, I started out with my, my usual rod. Major cross, craft cross judge. CRS 802. Uh, coupled with a 2,500 size uh, Thiawe Freens. Um, 16 pound braid and because it is rough I've got a 20 pound uh, fluorocarbon leader starting off with a 20 gram um, Zets Blatt slow jig a casting slow jig uh, it's got two really fine um, assist hooks and uh, a single I don't know if you can pick it up but it's rounded on the top and flat on the bottom that's designed to create a, a specific fluttering motion through the water. This is quite a wide flutter, um, so it covers a lot of area like that, and it sinks quite slowly. I know cod like to bite on the drop, um, and so do pollock as well, so that, that's the idea of this. If there are any mackerel around though, then this will just be food for them, and I'll, uh, I'll probably have to change, just because I'll not get through the mackerel. So, hopefully I can, uh, Catch a few fish here before I have to move on. JB, JB. Yeah, I like that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We don't stop, stop, stop. Whipping up. JB, this is the initial, gotta keep it, gotta keep it, gotta keep it, gotta keep it, gotta keep it official. Whipping up a game plan to set it off like a missile. Business is intact, now we come back strapped. So if something go down, we rearrange, we rearrange, we rearrange, we rearrange, we rearrange contracts. Coming right in exact to take your mental out the shack. Dunk your cookie in my milk and let it soak in my rap. On the mic, I talk about the plight to reach new heights. Put up a fight with everything in sight that blocks my life. Label my generation, 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 generation. Next one's the spot when it get hot. We don't stop to bust back. We just keep busting, just keep busting, just keep busting, just keep busting, just keep busting. No shots. Bulletproof brain cells, the name spells out success to remind you of a place so where the JBs rest. Lost that. Um, snagged. Probably using three hooks, I guess. Uh, gonna tie a longer leader on this time and uh, switch over to a soft plastic. It's not the neatest. Probably not pick it up, but 
That's a double uni knot. Um, it's the quickest and strongest knot that I tie out on the rock. Again, I've gone for 20 pound fluorocarbon and I've put on an 18 gram uh, Chabaruska with a size 1 0 Gamatsu uh, 3 3 0 bottom jigging hook and a little black and silver and gold curly tail grub. I'm hopefully going to bounce this along the bottom. Yeah, let's see if something bites it. Dump my import, make a million or more. Keep the radio rocking, still up the dance floor. When we come to the jam, no blessing, no gimmicks. Break it off in your right, till my style is no limits. Candle be high, like a true blue jungle G. I make the latest reply with the wink of an eye. Rhyme, but you drive the light in MCs like this. Make sure she has for competition, like slit in your wrist. Each sequel so lethal that no other can equal. Rock it up for the jam and rock it on for my people. Cause I'm a jungle brother, jungle brother. Cause I'm a jungle brother, jungle brother, jungle brother, jungle brother, jungle brother. Ripping up. Ha, ha. And I'm using the same setup, 18 gram Pro bottom jig, um, but I've swapped over to one of my favourite lures, a slider uh, grass minnow. I've actually added a tiny little rattle inside the tail as well, just to give it another sensory something else, really, for the uh, fish to get uh, interested in. Um, let's cast out. again this time I just lost my uh, my tackle the leaders held up um, it's been really slow around here I've had that one codlin and a few mackerel um, swell's not really dying down that much and the uh, wind's picking up a wee bit gonna go and try a shallower area sheltered by the headland I hope um, I doubt there's a chance of a big fish there but um, there's always a chance of a fish and uh, really what I'd like to do is catch a pollock and, um, and a cool fish and then I've caught four species in a day. So I'm going to pack up, head back up the hill, back to the car, uh, have a five minute drive and then another 10, 15 minute walk, see what I can come up with down there.
back on a, on a little 5 gram Savage Gear sand deal. I wasn't expecting to find that in this little bay. Yeah, so that's back row coddling and pollock now. Yeah.